What's up, community college crotch grabbers? Welcome to my never-ending nightmare. Ooh, baby, baby, do we have some more Ellen for you today. We are past the point of no return. We are finishing this goddamn fucking game, whether it kills me or not. I have said that once in my channel before, and I didn't finish the game. So, uh, just, uh, t t take, take, don't take, j definitely take my word for it. It's gonna happen. Okay. Um, but anyway, last time, w uh, before we had a little stuttering, stuttering ep ep episode. I don't, that's not a funny gag. I don't know why I did it. Anyway, <laughs> before we had a shitty stuttering joke that we tried to make funny twice uh the last episode we had a few notes right we had a few notes that we picked up that i need to read because i, I saved them for now because i thought you know what's gonna be the sickest way to start a new episode is read some lore of the game to the to, to the wonderful beautiful people watching so let's let's start with that noise uh this one's called weed killer which is nice um I might have finally got the solution to our little wee problem in the greenhouse. The exterminator told me that we got to it early. Uh, the exterminator told me that we got to it early. Should we have let it grow some more? It could have become very nasty. Oh, so that's just become pretty nasty by the looks of it. If you remember the big old fucking planto in the last game, pretty pretty solidly nasty, I would think. Um, luckily, he provided me with his weed killer recipe: 400 mils of white vinegar, 30 mils of plain alcohol, a spoon of salt. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, salt tends to kill most things. When when you when you oh rrr, I'm salty. Yar, I, I, what the f why am I being a pirate? <laughs> like it. It was like the most hackneyed fucking attempt at a joke relating the word salt to being grumpy. And then I fucking just did like a pirate impression somehow. I was like, yar in me hearties. Give me a spoon of salt or something. <laughs> Fucking hell, Jesus. I can't do a good pirate when I'm not trying to do a pirate. It's only when I don't mean to be a pirate that I make a good pirate. It's a very horrible paradox in my life. It's very difficult to try and do pirate ex impressions and not be able to do pirate impressions because you're a talentless hack. But then when you're not trying to do pirate impressions, you do really good pirate impressions. It's... it's <laughs> okay, that's enough of that. Um... If you can provide the reagents, I will make sure the greenhouse will be completely weed-free by tomorrow, sir. Baron. P.S. Do not mix the weed killer with any forms of compost. The exterminator explicitly warned me for this. Okay, I'm kind of want to try that now. Now that you've told me not to do it, you definitely know that I want to do it. Because that's the way the life works. The life, the world, whatever. The family doesn't come together for lunch anymore. How many more of these have we got? So I think by that, we're about halfway through the game, maybe? I don't know. We'll see. Um... I've been trying to figure it out. Uh, I would, I would reckon we're about halfway through with all the the uh, the, the language, the, the language, the notes, um, and the, uh, the the art and shit. And, and uh, well, we're gonna make the second half of the the uh, game take four times as long at this rate if we keep yapping shit over everything. So the family doesn't come together for lunch anymore. Let's have a read. The food on the table keeps getting cold. The family doesn't come together for lunch or dinner. I've asked for the family to have lunch and dinner at the right times and kept everything ready on the di dining table. But more often than not, I end up eating alone. Once I managed to get the kids on the table at time for lunch, but Mrs. Smith requested to have her food served in her room and Mrs. Smith locked himself in his office on the pretense of work. As I neared his office, the smell of tobacco permeated the air. He had recently relapsed into smoking. Poor guy, smoking's fucking terrible for you. Not that I would know because I've never had it, although... Everybody fucking knows because they 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 ran that shit down your throat, which is I mean, it's probably helped me because like I said, don't smoke. Um, Mr. Smith has also taken possession of the key to the basement door that leads to the backyard. Often it so happens that I go to check on the basement door to make sure that it is locked, only to find it ajar and Mr. Smith gone for a late night stroll. This worries me since I'm not entirely sure if Mrs. Smith knows about his nocturnal excursions. Oh, where's he going? He is he fucking some other broad? Is that what he's doing? He's got some side lass. <laughs> that he's he's cheating on Mrs. Smithy with. Oh, baby, don't tell me it's true. Don't tell me it's true. I don't want to know that. Uh, this seems like such a loving, kind family. Okay, we got. To, oh shit! Remember, remember that dude is right fucking there. Um, is there anything to the to the to the right of us? This is the way to the garden, was it not? Right. So let's. Oh god, there was some fucking noise out the right. It's probably not going to be out. You're probably not going to hear that on the capture. But like, I heard a, a ex exhalation. On the, the right side of my uh, my friggin' ears there. Um, is he gonna is he gonna kill me? Okay, we can do this. We can do this. We can do this. We can do this. Get behind there, baby. Yes. Okay. Sweet. 
So this is good. We are where we want to be, baby. Um, he's got quite a long uh, walk cycle here, so we can get out and we can... Oh, no, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't realize he was going to go right now. Anyway, oh, that's not the right one. Office. Oh, ooh, I need the key. He's not going to see me over here, surely. Uh, I have the key. Okay, cool. Okay, we just need to make sure it's on and just try not to get killed by this dude. Make sure there's no knifey knives coming out the side. No, we good. The door is unlocked. Okay, so we made it into the office. Is there going to be something that fucks me up in the office? Uh, I assume so. Uh, a very detailed bookcase. Nice, man. Um, what are you? It was given to Daniel Smith. Okie dokie. No worries. Hey, we got another note. That's cool. Let's, uh, let's have a read of this one. Seeing as this one's bloody, this episode is Note Evaluator 5000. Um, Juan Carlos Rodriguez. The very first file I received just mentioned his first name. Carlos. Okay, so this is, okay, this is Dr. Smith's office. That's kind of cool. Um, I assume, like, he's a, from what I gather, he's a psychologist or a psychiatrist or some shit. I'm assuming one of the two. Um, since I was seeing many other patients at the time, I declined his case. I couldn't accept another patient without compromising the time I gave to all my patients. As it, as it take what? As it taking a case requires a lot of preparation and a good amount of time getting to know the patient. A couple of days passed, and I received another patient request with the name Juan Carlos. Totally different dude, clearly. Um, <laughs> yeah, because there couldn't be two people in the in the world named Carlos and Juan Carlos and be different fucking people. Wow, I, we didn't know you were such an insensitive fucking douche. Actually, I am. Um, <laughs> we, 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 everyone clearly knew that. Anyway, as usual, I wrote back and told the patient that I was swamped with patients and that if he wishes, I can put his name on the wait list. He will be notified as a the time slots open up. Then on a fine Monday morning, there you go. You just knew he was going to meet the Juan Carlos on a fine morning. Um, I was having a cup of Joe in my room and preparing some notes on my patients who'd be coming up to see me that day when Baron knocked on the office door. He came in, came in and handed me the file. The third time, the patient name read as Carlo Juan Rodriguez, his full name. Hey, he's doing some fucking gymnastics there with his, uh, li literary gymnastics with his name, okay? I couldn't say no to Carlos anymore. He was desperately trying to reach me. Perhaps he was in a lot of pain and really needed my help with something. His approach to me was surely unusual, but being a psychiatrist, there you go, psychiatrist, not a psychologist. Fuck the psychologist, clearly. Gotta have a friggin' a medical degree up in here to... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why this is, why this is the thing. Spoiler alert, I did a psychology degree, so... Fucking, maybe I'm getting a little bit antsy about it for no goddamn reason alert. Uh, uh, reason alert? What the fuck am I talking about? For no goddamn reason. But also, another spoiler alert, I got shit marks as psychology anyway, so that, like, I, I'm not gonna be a psychologist. <laughs> didn't do good enough on dem tests, baby. Actually, it wasn't the tests that I didn't do good enough. It was the, the assignments. Um, anyway, enough about my fucking uni life. That is not going to interest or entertain anybody I assume because fucking god university Christ on a bike baby you don't want to know about that shit um with a diver okay by being a psychiatrist I have met many different patients with a diverse set of situations and problems I decided to make some time and start my sessions with Carlos as soon as possible Baron took my acceptance letter and sent it to the same address from where the patient's request file came from we got started the very next day Danny Smith. Good on you, Danny boy. I appreciate your work. Now, what's going to fucking happen now that I did that? Ingredient three? Pill jar? No. Not sure if it was for the patients or if it belongs to Mr. Smith himself. Well, every good psychiatrist is dipping his finger into the into the pill jar a little bit, obviously. There's a little red pin stuck on Mexico. Okay, so is he trying to run away to Mexico? Was he planning on doing that? Oh, we have some artwork. That's nice. I love a bit of artwork. <laughs> wow, I'm fucking just the best comedian in the world. Thank you for that. What the fuck? I miss Terry. Dad? Terry. Oh, so whose dad killed Terry? I mean, Terry probably deserved it for being a little shit. Let's be fucking honest. Like, if... If you just look at that fucking face there, right? You look at that stupid face of Terry. He's clearly doing some bullshit. He is up to no good. Is that a hammer? I think daddy killed him with a fucking hammer. That's great. I'm excited about it. I really want to... I really want to relive this... This, uh... This fantasy of mine. Uh, fantasy of mine? That's not what I want. Doctor of psychology. Um, that's not the same thing as a psychiatrist, actually, by the way. Uh, but anyway, someone was very proud of their achievements. Um, yeah, no, a psychiatrist is actually different to a doctor of psychology. A doctor of psychology would be someone who has, like, a PhD in psychology, right? Like, has a doctorate. 
if I'm not mistaken. I don't actually know how universities really work. <laughs> Clearly another a factor in um, uh, the, the life I currently lead, but uh, what have we got here? Music? Ooh, 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 have we had music before? No, we, it, it, it's nothing, again. That was nothing. Is there another one? Patient file, no, no. We got a music thing, but it didn't It didn't seem to have any music attached to it. We've looked at all these, haven't we? What about this one? Yes, Emily as well. We had a, we had a good, oh, Terry, did we have this one? So the famous boy at school as well, he always wanted to become like his father, and it, I don't think we've read this. Enjoyed talking to different people about their interests, and it would bring the conversation to an interest of his own. Basketball, which he loved to play. He wasn't allowed to watch a lot of television, so his interests were developed in a healthy environment. Terry also liked to write stories, and usually would do sport commentaries running around the house. On his 10th birthday, his parents gifted him a Walkman, and he was finally able to record his commentaries on an empty cassette to listen to them over and again and share with his friends okay so are we gonna is this music box gonna be like terry's fucking little stories or some bullshit i don't know let's just keep on walking baby let's keep on walking and we're probably gonna die soon i can only imagine something nothing has happened for a little while here so like there's definitely going to be something soon right half-filled alcohol bottle is that ingredient three maybe let's have a look see it must be ingredient three Ingredient one, ingredient three, ingredient two. Cool. All right. So we are all good here. It kind of looks like you were meant to go to the the office first, um, or the office afterwards, because it's it's the third ingredient. We've gone the other way and got the other two ingredients. So that seems strange. Even though the office, we had the office key way earlier, but um, I don't know if. Uh, oops, that's not what I meant to do. Oh, there we go. We figured out how to uh, remove these ingredients from the from the thing. Can we, can we, can we, can we use them together? Is that a thing that we can do? I feel like this is not a thing we can do, but, um, not useful. I don't know why I did it here. That seems like a really bad plan, but, um, any whom, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Now let's just see what the fuck is going to happen to the right here. Is it just like, Oh, there's something here. Piljana, we've already done that one. Is it lulling me into a false sense of security or is something going to fucking happen? Eep. Okay. Nothing there. Nothing there. Um, let's not run too fast because we don't know which side the big fucking monster boy is on. Uh, it doesn't seem like it's left, so we're gonna go right and, uh, cool. So we gotta hide again from the fucking sword throwing motherfucker. Which is, uh, you know, it's alright. I think we've gotta use, uh, so we're gonna, the obvious, uh, thing to do would be to use the, um, ingredients on the, on the plant, I suppose. Oh, 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 are you coming? Are you coming? Yes, you're coming. All right. <laughs> that was like... I was just like reenacting the worst sex anybody's ever had. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know why my brain went there. Are you coming? Yes. Yes, you're coming. That's great. I'm glad you're coming. <laughs> oh, what the fuck is wrong with me, man? Oh, Jesus Christ. Anyway, we got past this fucker. Um... Let's go. It wasn't in here, was it? No, it was in here. This isn't... No, this is the right way. It's locked up ahead. Oh, God. I feel like something's going to happen in here again. I'm coming! <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. No, this is the one that's locked. Okay, so this isn't where we were meant to go. Fair enough. We're meant to go all the way to the right. Yep, cool. Gotcha. Gotcha, baby. <laughs> Baby gonna jizz my pants. Baby gonna jizz my pants. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what am I fucking talking about? This is the most absurd bullshit. All right, is there gonna be something out here? I'm kind of feeling like there's gonna be something out here. We'll see. Uh, nope. Oh, it's making some sweet noises. Oh, 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 oh. The dog was there. I don't know if that dog's gonna fucking kill us, but it was fucking panting pretty hard. I don't like a panty boy. Um, I kind of want to see if this thing's going to kill us, but I don't want to see as well because I don't know if, uh, where'd it go? If it's going to start us from a shit spot. Let's see. No, he's just walking back there. He's just having a good old, good old walkie poo behind us over there. Just to kind of freak us out a little bit. You right there, buddy? You wanna, you wanna go to the pub, maybe have a few beers, you know, see where the night takes us? Sounds like a good idea, right? What are you doing? 
for cereal, dude. What are you? Stop breathing in my ear. It's kind of freaking me out. People who do that weird when they just like whisper it in your ear, like it's kind of and like makes your neck hair stand up and stuff. It, ugh, yucky. Oh, oh, uh oh. I can hear him like way more in here. It, oh, I think he's gonna kill me over here. If I'm being honest. Oh, is he gonna come get me? No. I, I can just hear him. But like, oh, is the plant dead? Is the plant not here anymore? Oh no, he's outside! The dog is literally outside! What the fuck, man? I didn't even realize the douche was like right there! Ugh, I, okay, so I'm assuming that fucker's gonna come see me sometime soon and give me the shits. Okay, maybe we... Not useful. Uh, is it one of these? Not useful. Uh, you. Not useful. What?! Um, not useful. Not useful. Okay, now I'm perplexed. Am I seriously not making weed killer with this shit? Uh, a hammer? Not useful. Uh, I, now I am lost, dudes. Needs a refill of what? Do I have anything else? I swore that was gonna be the thing to do, but... Is there like a mixing tray? For my ingredients? What the fuck, man? I don't know. I don't know what to do. I mean, we got these things, which I don't, I don't, I don't think I need to hide behind. We, we could give it a crack. Why not? <laughs> unnecessary. Completely unnecessary. For some reason, when I get lost in a game, I just decide to like fucking do dumb shit that doesn't make a difference to anyone's life. Um, so like, oh, stop panting at me. Ooh, it's making me my skin crawl a little bit. So the hammer, can we use the hammer on something? Is there anything, anything we can do around here? No. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Um. Oh, the noises, man. The noise in this fucking headphones. Jesus, why did I play it with headphones? It's like, this game is better with headphones. Well, fuck you. It's such a pain in the dick. Uh, hammer, okay. We're just gonna hammer shit till something happens. Um... This door. Oh god, that noise! Can we- can we mix something somewhere? Is that what's happening? Uh... Microwave. Uh, how about... Not useful. Used for warming up food. Uh, that one. Not useful. What used for warming up food. Uh, that one. Not useful. Okay! Well, seeing as I am uh, a little bit uh, lost though right right now, um, wait, what about the plants? Uh, these plants seem to have done nothing this whole time, and I suspect that's going to be the fucking case right now. But uh, okay, look, I'm gonna be honest with you, uh, I'm quite lost. I don't know what to do. Um, so I think what I will do is I'll call this an episode A, eh? and then I'm just gonna basically the next episode. When I figure out what the fuck to do, boy oh boy, uh, are we going to just hammer, ha hammer, straight in, baby. Um, but yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. Uh, very much appreciate every single goddamn one of you. I will see you in the next episode, you beautiful bitches.